Is this what it's like to be in the Animus? All right. Well, welcome everybody to the long-awaited Assassin's Creed Nexus. My hands are like balls of light, I guess. As you can see, we are in the Animus or, you know, wherever. Um, sorry it took so long to make this. I've seen so many people in my comments asking where a video on this game was. I was working on that Mirage review for a long time, so I'm a little bit late to playing the game, but I'm very excited to get into it. Obviously, I've made videos on uh, Blade and Sorcery's Assassin's Creed mod. A lot of you really liked those, and those mods are so good, so is it might be hard for this game to live up to those. I don't know. I've completely avoided everything with this game. I have not seen any spoilers. I haven't even seen any gameplay really, aside from like the trailers and stuff, of course, but I kind of just wanted to go in with a fresh experience for you guys. Yeah, we're just gonna start from the beginning here. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna make this a full playthrough. If you guys want that, maybe we could do that. But for now, we'll just start with this video and uh, see where to go from there. But yeah, let's go uh, new game. Game difficult, casual, normal, hard. Let's start with normal. I'm actually pretty excited. <laughs> for centuries, the Brotherhood of Assassins and Templar have waged a secret war for the future of humanity. Free will versus societal control. Simplification, but yeah. You're an elite Brotherhood hacker sent to undercover to work for Abstergo, the Templar's modern day front. You learn of a Templar plan for influencing society their beliefs. Stopping that plan is up to you. Okay. Whoa. Whoa, what? I don't know if you guys can see this, but um, oh my god. Whoa. I'm not sure if you guys can see this, but it's actually like showing my real vision right now. And I have to touch the cube to start. That is really cool. Oh my god. Press to answer. Voice core. Select virtual voice. Uh, masculine? Testing, testing. I just... One, two, three. That'll okay, do. Okay, is that my voice? This is so weird. Ah, but really... Hello there. Thanks Sean! For making call. I'm Sean, and this is Rebecca. We're your Rebecca! For this, our this is so weird, but so cool. Developing a new Even normal people like you and me. I don't think I'd call you normal, Sean. Very funny, but the point yeah, is, yeah, you're, you're not very normal, Sean. Could be Anna Templar beliefs. So where do I come in? The executive in charge of this initiative, Dominica Wilk, needs someone with your skills to finish the project, but she doesn't know you're working for okay. us, or that you're going to shut her operation down for good. But more on that. So we're a spy. For now, we'll piggyback on your connection, so we'll be there when you need us. All right that there I love how they designed this this is really huh. unique what have we here Conversation is this a puzzle safely. yeah okay so I gotta like that there and then okay interesting I didn't think our character would actually have a voice either that's pretty cool I thought we'd just be like a mute protagonist Either it's taking forever to load or it like crashed. What is happening? <laughs> what is happening? All right, so the game has already crashed, but uh, not a great start, but it's all right, let's get back. Whoa. Ah, you must be the hacker. As ordered. Good, I'm Dominica Wilk. You'll report to me. Okay. These are impressive. And so is your track record. This is the Abstergo Cloud. Uh, it's an archive of memories fancy. stretching back through time. We use a technology called the Animus to visit these memories, seeing them through the eyes of those who lived them. What is this, time travel? It's a simulation. No action you take in the Animus can directly affect the present. Where do I start? It's more of a who than a where. Ezio Auditore di Firenze, an Italian noble and a master assassin. Sounds like Oh, Ezio. He was. Ezio with was the new threads. Leonardo da Vinci and Machiavelli and a sworn enemy of the Borgias. He touched many lives. And Ezio looks a bit century. odd. <laughs> and his blade ended more than a few. Count me in. Let's this is definitely call. the woman from Deadpool and Gotham. I can't, I'm blanking on her name, but that's definitely her, I think, the actress. 
Do you have experience with VR games? Yes, I do. Have you played any VR games where you move? Yes. No. Well, I mean, I do, but like, eh, it's not too bad. Interesting. Okay, so they got a bunch of options to help people who have fear of heights and everything. I don't really have a fear of heights. At least I don't think so. Yeah, I'll do the immersive preset. Whoa! I'm Ezio! To the, Animus Orientation the real Podcast. Ezio! I will guide you through the basics of using oh. the Animus. Your avatar Sick. is now active. You should be able to move around freely. What? Yep, yep, okay, move around. A rat? Hold to grab items, yeah. It's like every VR game. Got it. Objects will generate noise when thrown or dropped. Okay, cool, cool. Can I open this? Ooh. Close. Am I supposed to go out the door? Once again, my path leads back to Venice. Alas, I must deny my friends here the pleasure of my company. I have a sword. Roger Craig Smith! And a lesson to teach. No one steals from an auditore and leaves to boast about it. Oh man, it feels so weird hearing Ezio's voice again after all these years. This may be the last time we hear Ezio in a new Assassin's Creed game. That's really sad to think about. Unless they like remake the Ezio trilogy, which they might one day. I could see them doing that, especially since they're already doing Black Flag. But... Man, it's good to hear Roger Craig Smith back. And Noah Watts is back for Connor, too. I, uh, checked the credits on, uh, I checked the credits for the game, and yeah, it's Noah Watts voicing Connor again as well. Okay. Oh, hold on. I don't know how to open doors. Sorry, I'm stupid. We were Reach the, the lower floor. Right now, oh, we got guards there? Is this like Blade and Sorcery, where you just have to mimic sprinting and it makes you run faster, or how does that work? The graphics look pretty nice, though. For VR, it looks pretty good. Oh, boy. Oh, okay. Better be careful here. You must make your way through the library without being detected. If you're spotted, Press X to you'll crouch or physically and lower yourself. Start from your last okay. Checkpoint in this cool. memory. I'm crouched. Using vision and sound. Well, can I assassinate this guy? Or should I just go around? This feels weird. I really was looking forward to the chance to do a little, shall we say, acquisitions work. Okay. Gotta get down a little bit lower. I have bills to pay. They won't give me credit down at the wine shop. Okay, he can't see me. It's all right. Your money was burning a hole in like a true assassin. So I believe this version of Ezio is after Brotherhood, but before Revelation. So he's still a little bit older, like 50s maybe, 40, late 40s, early 50s, I think. Well, I think he's in his 50s in Revelations, right? 50s, 60s. Uh, okay, let's throw that over there. Nice. Sneak What's through. making that noise? I have no idea, man. I mean, I'll just be. Yep. See ya. VR is just the animus, basically. But I mean, Assassin's Creed has always been perfect for VR, just with the premise of the animus and everything. It's about. You are now going to oh. learn how to assassinate a target. Oh, okay. Flick your wrist outward while holding the trigger button to draw your hidden blade. Oh. Once the blade sweet. is drawn. You can use it to assassinate your unsuspecting target. All right. Ready for our first assassination? Nice. You have mastered the art of assassination. Now okay. proceed with your mission. Cool. What's this? This a map of Montregioni. A chest? Can I? Let me. Oh, that's the thing I had earlier. Give me this. I must be missing something. So there's puzzles in this too, huh? Alright. I'm not great at puzzles, I gotta warn you guys. Do I put these together? Oh! Together. But where do they go? They go in here, if I can... Wait, like this? Yeah, like this. Push it in. <laughs> I can't... There we go. I keep, dude, X is like in a weird spot. Okay. 
Grab the edge of climb, pull yourself up, and release to mount. Okay. Nice. That was smooth. I should never have been away so I will long. kill you. Is my carriage ready? Yes, mistress. Good. Now put your back into it. No time to waste. Yes, mistress. Yes, mistress. Poor guy. All right. Let's parkour. To reach the next room, you will need to climb this wall. Try okay. it now. Oh yeah, this is just like Blade and Sorcery. Okay, nice. Is a treasure room of some kind. Oh, a crown? Don't mind if I do. Put that on my on my assassin hood. Come on. Ezio, we all know you're the king of this series. Press Y. Which one's Y? Okay. Oh, I need to climb up, perhaps. <laughs> Oh, look at all the NPCs. Oh, there's a guy right there. Uh, I grab there. Nice. There it is. Here it There's is. my sword. A note. What's this? A sword is attractive, but ultimately useless for our purposes. It is not the item we need. We must plan more carefully and try again. There is no. Well, screw you. My sword is very useful. Alright, let me take this beauty. Look at the pommel. That's very unique. My Yatagan. Such an elegant blade. Okay, I do have double hidden blades, I was gonna say. Uh where to now? Find a way out of the room. Ah. Door. ah time to get out of here. Give me more enemies here, perhaps. No? Okay. Oh, okay, I think I need to go combat here. What's up? What's up? Oh, they want to do now that. Defeat the guard. The animus combat protocol. Loading standard okay. enemy profile. Stand Got it. And face me. Man, you telegraph your attacks very easily. You're done for. Easy. Come on. What else you got? Lock attack sequence, got it. Locking a series of enemy attacks opens up windows to strike. Can I just stab Use him right here? Chances to slash an enemy. Oh, slash, okay. Yeah. A well placed attack will stun. Nice. This will allow you to oh, strike. Oh, you're lucky. Can I actually stab or can you only slash? Oh, you can stab. Strike insufficient to cause damage. Oh. Training rated a success. There we go. It doesn't seem to be quite as violent as Blade and Sorcery, but that's okay. <laughs> Alright. But there is always a way through. I could use this to distract the guards. Can I air assassinate from here? How do you air assassinate? Okay, I missed. It's alright, he didn't hear anything. Got him. Okay, he just fell through the wall, that's fine. This is really cool though, that's actually focused on stealth. That's the one thing about Blade and Sorcery, it's kind of hard to do stealth. I mean, it's possible, don't get me wrong, but it's like... It doesn't have like a very consistent detection system or anything. Okay. Let's crouch. Nice. And those actually one-shot them. Those kidney shots. Alright, one more. Let's crouch. We gotta distract him with this. Go get it! Oh, that's not where I wanted it. Shoot. What's that? Nope, nope, you're not gonna detect me. Go investigate over there. Oh, he didn't see me. What's this? 
Can we double stab? Oh, I missed! Eh, it's all good, we got him. Can you stab them when they're dead? No, you can't! Oh, that's lame. Oh, well. Yeah, not as violent as Blade and Sorcery. I pull myself up. Here we go. This world is my game. But my heart is not yet at ease. Press A while moving to parkour. It is time I went home. Right. Oh, we're going back to Monteregioni? Okay, that's how we jump. Oh, okay, that's nice. That's pretty easy. I was worried that might be difficult. Well, that's how you sprint. Okay. Whoa. Wee! I'm doing it. I'm doing parkour. Oh my gosh. It's so fast. Oh. Look at all the NPCs. What? This is awesome. Look at all the NPCs. That's so impressive. Title card? What a title card. Got the eagle. Fireworks. Man. Cool opening. I'm excited now if it's gonna be like this. Oh, hello. First time in the Animus. I'm a quick study. Thank you. Now how about we take the training wheels off? With the code from those missing fragments, we can bring the old and the new together and create a computer more powerful than we've seen before. Interesting. I call the project the Nexus Eye. And now you're a part of it. Ah, uh, you I said the title. Where are these fragments? Do I stay with Ezio? For now, but in time you'll visit other memories. We'll have cool. to see where the search leads. Yes. I don't know if we'll get to Connor in this video, but I definitely want to make a video once I get to the Connor section as well. Oh, we're back here. Okay. Open secure connection. We need to talk. Meet us in a secure environment. Disconnect. Okay. Brotherhood core. Got it. And then here. Incorrect. Is that not it? Oh my gosh. Okay. Whatever. Don't forget. We'll start here. In a three-dimensional space. Yeah, I get it. Thank I get you, it. Rebecca. I think our friend knows how this works. Yes, I know how this works. Thank you, Sean. Here. Okay, this time I got it. And then here. Cool. Ooh, she'll be watching. Is that Rebecca? Oh, what's up, guys? She'd never leave. You've heard what she has. Where's Basim? Now remind me what you want from me. When is this taking place in the timeline exactly? Now, this okay. particular code you whipped up is one of the neatest logic bombs I've ever Sean, seen. Sean, you're looking it's a little creepy. Return to Monteregioni. Ezio travels to his ancestral home to reunite with his sister. Oh, so Claudia's in this game. Oh, all right. This looks very good. It has been far too long. It has been far too long. What's up? How you guys doing? Thank you. I have returned. Hello, high five. Oh, okay, never mind. Ah, where is Claudia? Is that Claudia? Thank you, sir. Claudia. Master Ezio, I am You're not Claudia. Your sister sent me to meet you. Oh. Okay. Pride. My only sister is so busy. She must send a servant to greet me. I spoke in jest. It is a pleasure to meet you. It's good Ezio still has a sense of humor. <laughs> Thank you, I am the best protagonist in this series. So... Yes, I am. Is this the first time we're seeing... Monteregioni after its destruction and Brotherhood? Like, it's completely rebuilt and everything. The NPC density is super impressive for VR. Like, and this game is running well, too. No performance issues at all. Look at that. Oh, man. You even got NPCs working on stuff like this? Hey, give me that. Give me, give me that. Can I... Nope. I, I've come back to Mari trying to kill you guys. I'm sorry. Whoa. Got it. What? There's one on the top of Villa Auditory. Make your way there now. What is this? It's all miniature now. Oh my. Is this what it's like to be Godzilla? This is so weird. <laughs> okay. 
So I just gotta go there? Is that what's telling me to do? Take a look. Best in all the city. Okay. What if no I kill you? Whoa. Are you sure? How can I Give me everything you got. Give me everything you own. Where are you going? Where where are you going? Okay. Um, I'll just be taken. Okay, I can't. Never mind. I own this place. Oh. Once you've synchronized much of each memory's top level. Well, let me drink water. Ooh. Look at this. Awesome. Can I do some parkour? Oh god. Yeah, there we go. Okay. We just missed that. Hold on. Let's try that again. Let's do some free running. Okay, I... I think I'm done harassing the citizens. Super speed, hidden blade. Oh, they're rebuilding? Let's climb up. Man, this is really cool. Why? Okay. All right. Synchronize. There. Synchronize where you see that animus node inviting you to interact. Okay. With it. Do I pick it up? Oh, I guess I do. But Extend arms and jump. I have an oh idea. boy, we're gonna Let's do our leap of faith. In the memory. Guys, it's time to do the leap of faith. All right. This looks horrifying, but let's do it. I'm inside the haystack. So this is what it looks like. Did you guys see that? I jumped from up there. It actually wasn't too bad. It was way less nauseating than I thought it would be. Oh, Grab okay. The construct to begin. Oh, we got a parkour challenge? Alright. I'm in the wall. I, okay. There we go. We got Ezio's family, a little remix. Nice. Calibration that was it. 50%. The parkour actually feels a lot smoother than skills. Blade and Sorcery, I'll say that. Climb to the top of the church to collect the construct. It's a little bit more automated, but it works pretty well, actually. All right, leap of faith. All right. Okay, and then we... Nice. Oh, I overshot it. <laughs> the rumors are true. There will be plenty of money soon enough. What are you two talking about, huh? Get back to work! Careful with what that. The? Get back to Can work! Oh. Sorry. This servant's entrance. I always preferred this way. Ah, oh, it's so good to hear your voice again, Ezio. Okay. Meet with Claudia. Got it. Man. Ah, <sighs> the nostalgia. Where's Claudia? Not in here. Where? Is Claudia? Answer me. Okay. Is she down here? In here, maybe? Is that what's trying to tell me? Oh no, there she is. No, I have grown tired of repeating myself. You will work where I tell you to work. Claudia. You still have a way with handsome young men, Claudia. Brother, much like you, Ezio, that man was neither young nor handsome. Oh, you wound me. Oh please, your pride is more resilient than armor. I'm glad you are here now, in the present, as is Monterigioni. Monterigioni has never recovered from the siege, has she? No. Ah, the siege. Some workers to do some repairs on the villa weeks ago. Since then, they've been coming to the city like ants on the scent of sugar. Take that model of the watchtower and place it on the map. My pleasure, dear sister. Okay. <laughs> no, that's not good. Okay. I'll go do it now, ma'am. 
I can't tell if that's the same voice actress for Claudia or not. I don't think it is. It probably isn't, but still cool to see Claudia in the game. All that really matters is that we got Roger Craig Smith for Ezio back. He wasn't supposed to be here for a few more days. There's definitely something weird going on here. I suggest you get back. Oh nice. That's convenient. Oh. The music box Claudia spoke of, if I am not mistaken. I recognize Leonardo's handiwork. I expect there will be more to this than it seems. Assassin's Creed 2 music playing as well? Perfect. What is this? Can I play? I can? Sweet. Come on. Something I can How do I... Be nearby. How do I play this thing? Playing this honestly really does feel like I'm playing Assassin's Creed 2 or something. I'm not even gonna lie. Like, the music, the setting, it's very- it feels very familiar in that sense. Uh, perhaps? Wait, that goes here. Nice. Need one more. Here? Nope. Nope. Where is it? This chest? No. In here? Where is this thing? This one? Ah, there it is. Huh. Can I put it on? I do not think so. I need this. Nice. Okay. Ezio's family. A letter from Leonardo, Ezio. I hope this brings you some joy. Leonardo. The last painting is but a poor substitute for friendship. God willing, I will see you again soon. Maybe so, old friend. It's just so good to hear Ezio's voice again, man. It's like it's comforting. That's it's what it is. He plucked her from heaven. Oh, look and at gave that. Her new life. Grazie, Leonardo. I shall treasure this until my last day. Is Ezio's mother still alive at this point? I don't know. I don't. It doesn't seem like it. I don't ever actually remember her dying in the games, though, unless I'm forgetting. Obviously, Claudia is still here, but. Hurry, bring it down. Uh oh. Oh my god! Oh my god, that scared me. What? Whoa. Okay. <coughs> it's different when it falls on you. Oh my, it's this woman. What? What did I do to you? I don't even know who you are. What a betrayal by the woman who greeted us. So, these workers have shown their true faces. The uh -huh. I leave for them, I still live. Yeah, there we go. Nice. Oh. There's a dead guy right there. Hey, hey man, you all right? Oh. Oh, let's go, Claudia. Oh. Okay. brother. We have vermin to exterminate. Your present was a gift of fate. Nicely done. Indeed, you. Are you taller than me? I shall read the villa. How are you taller than me? You'll bump me with Rid the, the villa of the bandits. Warning, don't say things like that or I'll do for you. Got it. Yes. Okay. Doesn't know I'm here. Got him. Even though I don't really think that was in a fatal spot, whatever. Uh, two more upstairs. Oh, look at this little secret passage. Oh, he's right there, though. Can I ledge assassinate, maybe? Well, I got him. I 
think. Did I? I, I guess. Okay. That's an interesting bug. Okay. I want double. Ah! Nice. So where did he go? And his body just disappeared. Okay. Alright. Oh my! What was that? Alright. Oh, where are you going? The book, isn't this from, uh... Yeah, this is the same entrance from, uh, Brotherhood. When they all escape, you know? That's the exact same exit they use. Oh, that's a cool detail. I wonder how long this opening Ezio section is. We still haven't played as Connor yet, Cassandra. Oh, there's a lot of them. Hello. Is this a combat area? Yeah, alright. Let's go. You're no match for Ezio Auditore! What? Now what initiating the Animus Advanced Combat Protocol. Oh, Loading Professional combat. Soldier Enemy Profile. Strike the enemy's Harry. weapon with your own just before it hits you. Time okay. it right and you will open them to a counter attack. Did I do it? That time I did. Strike I the think. enemy's weapon while they're attacking. Look at your target to aim. Okay. Press A to combat dash. Oh! Alright. Okay, lunge attack. User training successful. Nice. Exiting Animus Advanced Combat Protocol. <laughs> the reins are off! Let's go. Let's see what you're made of! Oh! Perry! Nice! I must follow quickly if I wish to stop them. Altair! Perhaps we shall meet What's up? Unlock the combat dash. There's an upgrades menu? That's cool. There's actual progression. Oh, there's Aya, Amunet. Hello. I am gone, but for a moment, and my sister starts changing things. <laughs> oh. The moves have entered the tunnels through the crypts. That's pretty easy. I must hurry. They cannot be far ahead. And now you get to plant a beacon and a logic bomb with it. Just okay. grab the data node, and you're all set. Oh, this premise is really cool. Let's catch up. Best to stay undetected. Should we not have ensured Ezio was dead? We do not need him on our set like a dog. <laughs> Signore Ezio rests with his ancestors. Like, why would you ever want to mess with Ezio? You have to be a special kind of dumb. This man has killed Cesare Borgia, and this woman thinks she is the one who can take him down. Okay. Parkour! Nice. I can still move when I need to, which is too far even for me to jump. Parkour! It's a pity they have been overlooked for so long. This one is unaware of me. A fine target for my blade. Use that guard below right. as an opportunity to review Ooh, air, assassinations. air assassinations. You will first need to have a weapon ready. Draw your sword or hidden blade. Either will do. Highlight your target by looking at it, then There's pressing A to jump. Down here. Tell it to someone else. Oh! Oh, nice! Whoa! I was sick! Okay, that's actually really cool. I like how they did those air assassinations. I was worried they might be a little bit too difficult to pull off, but no, that was actually very easy. Swing while jumping by grabbing a bar and swinging yourself forward. Okay. Oh, nice. Man, you can actually do so much with the parkour in this. More than I expected. <laughs> okay, I just jumped right through the... And these tunnels are huge. Serafina says the assassin could be right behind us. Calm yourself, Codardo. He's just one man. Who just happens to be okay. a master assassin. 
Please, Seraphine. Yeah, yeah, you she said my name. Need to find We gotta swing again. Oh no, I missed. Oh man. Okay. Swing, ready? Nice. I feel so weird. You still think oh. Ezio is alive? Air assassination? I am sure of it. Come now. He was tired, outnumbered, in his best gear. Run! 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 Haha, what's up? We got chase. Your end is at hand. All right. You will not get away from me. Let's go. Run like the wind, Ezio. Huh. 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 Have you now? Oh, climb, climb. Ah. Come on. Oh, what? That's not fair. My father and brother deserve justice! Those of us on the right side of knowledge have squared ourselves against you. Seraphina, come. We I need a projectile. She really thinks she stands a chance. It's kind of adorable. How naive. Ezio has faced far worse than you. Throwing knives? Ooh. Oh, my chest holster. Oh! Nice. How do I throw it? Oh! Okay, like that. Got it. I only get two of them to start. Yeah! Bro, there was a key right here. Wow, that guy's dumb. What is that? Okay. A coin? He's throwing that. Okay. That nice. That's the problem with these old tunnels. There are all sorts of accidents waiting to happen down here. Any luck? Oh, maybe I should have used that to kill them. Oh, got one. Oh, oh, I just did like a manual air assassination there. Can I pick this throwing knife back up? I can! Ooh, more throwing knives. Did you hear what I said? Yes. Hold on. I, I need to. I can hit this. A can go to hell with... That's not what I wanted to do. That one. Get him. I missed. Oh my gosh. It's a good thing there's a refill right here. Let's go to the other side. No, I fell. Oh God. What's the fuss? Nope, you did. You did not see me. You did not see me. You, you did not see me. I don't know how I even got up here. You don't see me. Oh, yeah, you do. Oh, God. Oh, there's one right there, too. Are you... Ah, I'm screwed. I'm screwed. There's no way. I'm gonna get spotted. I made it back down. Kill this guy. Yes. I'm gonna hit this guy with my throwing knife. Nice. The throwing knives are OP. You get auto aim, basically. Wait, can I throw my throwing knife all like this? I missed. What have we here? Nice. That ought to do it. That was close. Oh. That has to be surprised that we'll open this gate. Wasn't perfect, but we did it. Man, this woman is elusive. Okay. Defeat the bandit's commander. Alright. Combat. Some enemies have special attacks that cannot be blocked. These must be dodged instead. Alright. Dodge unblockable attacks. Okay. When he does it though, he is opened up for an attack. Hey. Right. What? Oh. Okay, you can also crouch. Alright, can I kill him now? I think so. Sound the alarm! Ugh. 
Oh, got him. We got more. Bring it on. Ah, arrows? Got him. Got him. Nice, okay. Alright, can we kill this woman already? Oh, rope lift? Sweet. Oh, okay. Leave the tunnels. Montregioni. I failed to protect you once before. On my honor and the memory of my uncle Mario, I shall not fail you again. Hello, mention of Mario. That's nice. Oh. Oh my god. What? How? How'd this happen? Not again! Bandits have done their work well. How could I have been oh, so you gotta king me. The fault is mine, dear sister. I have failed you and Monterigioni. I heard Serafina and her me? men talk of Venice and their patrons. It's Cesare's siege all over again. It is there that we just rebuilt this place. Family treasures. Then why do you waste your time here with me? Let Antonio know you are coming and then on the road to Venice with you. Bring back what is ours and show our foes the auditories are not to be trifled with. You will see to Monterigioni. This will not be my first time rebuilding the city, brother. Go, and may the spirit of yeah. vengeance go with you. Activate the beacon. What? Oh. Okay. All right. Well, I think we're gonna end the this first video here, folks. Just a little introduction into the game. We got a good amount of missions done with Ezio. I'm really enjoying this so far. Um, aside from getting a little motion sick here and there, it's been pretty fun. Uh, you know, it, it may not be, the combat and everything may not be uh, quite as developed and fleshed out as say Blade and Sorcery, but still really fun. The stealth is actually surprisingly really good. Um, the throwing knives, the air assassinations, it all works really well. The parkour works really well too. I really am, am enjoying this so far, and playing as Ezio again has just been awesome. I can't wait to get to the Connor part as well, and uh, see what's up next. But yeah, it, again, um, I don't know if we'll make this a walkthrough or whatever. I haven't really decided yet, but if you guys want to see that, let me know, and uh, we'll make another video on this. But yeah. Oh, and I really like the modern day part too as well. I like that whole element so far. But yeah, thank you for watching, everybody. As always, if you enjoyed, I'd appreciate it if you left a like. Consider subscribing if you're new. Thank you to my members. And uh, other than that, thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day, Assassins.